Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! Kenny! What the fuck?! Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. It looks too quiet. Made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We should go. Motels run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. I saw military chief. Looks like the military Shit. has you been okay? in town. The ladder's come loose. I'm not oh. sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. This could be dangerous if I slip and knock myself out. I'm quite the slipper. <laughs> oh. Looks like well? she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. I better get a move on. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. You might recognize uh, this place. Uh, this is the drugstore we were stuck in, and uh, hmm. looks like it still works. Maybe if we could push this jeep, but it looks quite heavy with the rocks in it. Hmm. Huh. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. I wonder where all the zombies went. There's no corpses outside here. Huh. Hmm. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Let's see if we can find something over here. There's no safe way through that mess.
Kenny, come on. Ah, shit. Damn it. I can't reach. <sighs> Sorry, pal. All right, stay put. I think Kenny might be hurt. He was shot in the last episode, so that's probably why he um, uh, squealed in pain when we walked earlier. And it can take quite a while before you recover because when you get shot, it's well, it's quite rippling to your muscles. Hmm. Maybe if I could take this vinch and do something. It's completely flat. That's not good. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? It's not good. I'm worried. No shit. There's a lot to be worried about. She's gonna snap. Hmm. I wonder what this is gonna do. Winch control. Let's test this. Ah! Uh -huh. upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week. I uh, hope not. Hoping ain't worth a damn. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, shit! Jesus, are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. No, get ah! off here. Scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Oh, she's bitten. We, we just have to go. Shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Happens when she's bitten, so there's no point. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Let's pick 
as much. Oh, I missed something. Ah, no time. She's gone. There's not much time now. They're knocking on the doors. Perhaps we should leave soon. I'm quite good at this scavenging. <laughs> Leave me. I'm so strong. Fridge. Oh, now, nice. Let's fucking get out. Let's run. Let's run. Oh, there is a military pilot. Get the fuck away from me! Hit him! That's a pilot. What was that? They're everywhere! You took care of yourself, didn't you? Looked like he was uh, holding back a little. Not sure why. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone and come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's we not have graffiti. to go because there's holes. not enough we food enough and the bandits out of it to dry our laundry. And that's all is going to be a problem. Is busting at the seams with Walker. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. So, you two are uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. Ken, we're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No. Because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. What about medicine? What about medicine? Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. 
What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers, and the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! A betrayer in the group. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Uh, rough day, I guess. Yep, I've just been calling them days lately. I don't know what it is, but it's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now, if she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. Could be that as well. But uh, usually it's better to trust someone's instincts rather than just doubting them. Let's uh, check in with her. It might be good if she's feeling down, which she probably is. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Seems like you're manufacturing this from nothing. Prove me wrong. I'd really appreciate it. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. Robin, I know who it is? <laughs> From Batman. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. That's a cool kid.